Now, your two works for you weather, sponsored by Executive Homes. And we have begun a uh, stretch of sub-freezing temperatures. Officially this morning, we dropped below freezing, and potentially we could not cl- we might not climb above freezing until maybe next Thursday, the way it appears right now. And that's if we're lucky. Let's go ahead and show you right now, looking at temperatures across the region, the deep freeze is upon us here in northeast Oklahoma as temperatures will continue to be cold the next several days down in the teens and 20s across the area. Right now, we're below freezing, well below. Tulsa, 21. These are air temperatures. Bartlesville coming in at 16 degrees. And the McAllister still above freezing right now at 38 degrees. We are watching this area of freezing drizzle that continues to move from southwest to northeast across the metro region, and this could accumulate more ice within the next hour. Let's check on the roadways once again. Meteorologist Annie Brown in the Arturley Roofing Storm Truck. Annie, give us an update on the road conditions right now. Yeah, Mike, I've been keeping a close watch on these. Still, those main roads uh, have been salted fairly well, so not really the issue. It's those back roads. We're back on I-44. A couple cars, uh, tires were starting to spin out at stoplights. Allow that extra time. I cannot stress that enough if you're having to get out and about. So the main roads are looking good, but as we're coming up on some of these bridges, I've noticed a lot of cars slowing down. Take your time. I do expect more black ice to start to develop as we head into the evening. Now that salt is effective for now, but concerns are growing over the next several days as that Arctic air mass continues to drive into the area. Uh, that went down to near 10 degrees uh, Fahrenheit or below. That is not going to help make that salt effective. So concerns that we will continue to have this ice rink across the area. I'm meteorologist Annie Brown reporting live. Back to you, Mike. Great job, Annie. Thank you very much. That's very useful information, especially over the next couple of days. Now, temperatures, again, as we end a Thursday, still in the 20s. We look to Friday, still cold, teens and single digits. Saturday, we might actually drop below zero. And we might even get close to an all-time record low in Tulsa, which is 14 below. We might get close to that on Sunday morning. Now, by next Wednesday, we're starting to warm into the upper teens. So we stay cold across the area all the way through at least next Wednesday, the way it appears right now. As far as snowfall chances, there is a chance for more freezing drizzle Tuesday night and Wednesday morning, which will cause more slick spots. But as we head into Saturday, we could see a few little snow showers in the area which might create a little bit of a dusting, maybe a half inch of snowfall across the area. It will be light amounts as we head into Saturday. But look at the temperature trend on the downward cycle, eight degrees by Sunday. Tomorrow morning, a very cold start to the day. Should be dry in the morning, temperature lower 20s, only mid to upper 20s for your afternoon highs. The next 10 days, going to be very, very cold below freezing all the way through the next 10 days with highs remaining in the single digits on Sunday, teens by next week. Much more.